There's some new information tonight in an ongoing I-Team investigation into mystery notes being found in sealed food products and at state parks in Pennsylvania. The cryptic messages have raised a lot of questions and concerns from folks all across NEPA as 2822 News I-Team reporter Andy Mahalshik joins us now live in the studio. And Andy, what have we learned today? Well, Nick, the I-Team has confirmed that federal investigators are hot on the trail of the sources of these notes and what the words and symbols on these notes might mean, if anything. I mean, it just bothers me that, I mean, the note really, it's not the note that really bothers me, it's just what was, it's, uh, these notes are found inside food, like kids, kids' food. Joe Miller found a cryptic note inside a box of cereal he bought in the Hazleton area in late December. Since our initial report, the I-Team has been contacted by people from all over Pennsylvania telling similar stories. This map shows just some of the areas where notes were found in all types of food and other products purchased from large and small stores. They were also found pinned to trees in state parks. The notes contain symbols as well as words that appear to reference conspiracy theories. I talked with Miller this week to get his take on what he thinks about who is behind this and their motivation. I tend to think it's some kind of group, maybe. Um... I don't know if it's like political. Congressman Dan Muser, who along with Congressman Matt Cartwright has been looking into these mystery notes, received a response from the FDA. It reads in part, FDA has investigated the matter and determined based on the product packaging process and various plant locations that these localized incidents are more suited for complaint referrals to the jurisdiction of several PA state and or local agencies. For these reasons, the FDA has been providing these agencies with these reports for their evaluation and possible follow-up. So what do these notes mean, if anything? The I-Team has been working with computer engineer and programmer Spencer Rappaport from Kingston, who has been trying to decipher the words and symbols on these notes. From other individuals I've talked to that work in the field, um, we've collaborated. There are links to some websites that we're trying to track down, but other agencies have stepped in to do it. Now, the agencies Rappaport is talking about, based on his research and ours, include the FBA, FBI, and the FDA. And the FBI spokesperson tells me they do not confirm or deny the existence of any investigation as standard policy. Now, we have more information on these latest developments, as well as our previous reports on our website, PAHomepage.com. Guys, we'll stay on it. Back to you. Part of a long-term investigation there. Thanks, Sandy. A 